If your nib's too slow and your ink won't flow, here's one of the places that you can go. Larry is here to help you through with Mr. Announcer and Cubby too. It's Larry's Fountain Pen Review. Happy Halloween, everybody. Larry here, and welcome to Larry's Fountain Pen Review. Well, soon, Halloween will be here before you know it. So, I am going to work on this cool video that has this cool bags, and they're called the what, Mr. Announcer? Inktopus. Yes, that's what they are called. You've probably already seen them. But you want to check out my video. Why? Just because. So have you heard of Ink Journal? Uh, right here, I got them right here. You can join the Ink Flight. Go to the website and sign up because, hey, a club for fountain pen lovers, look no more. Pen enthusiasts, ink friends, whatever, here it is just waiting for your order. So with that said, we'll have to wait for the fun to begin, right? I'll see you in a few. Hi folks. Hey, join me and let's take a ride with the new Intubus A5 zip pouch bag. And it's right here. Bam. Turn this little jewel around. Can you dig the drawing? Look at the picture of this octopus. Right. That is to me just very cool. Love it. This bag has character, personality, all in one. Right. Love the colors. They all blend together. And of course, it's made by no other than Rickshaw. So you know you're getting your money's worth. I do love the zippers on this bag as well. The nylon cords, they match the bag and they just do a good, good job of zip and unzip of the bag. So, this bag is actually a nice roomy sized bag. So let's just uh, take a some stuff out and we'll put some stuff in and just have some fun okay first of all let me take the pen sleeve out okay right here my friends is the rickshaw bag it's called the ink journal koozie case neptune blue really is a nice pen sleeve pen case and just look at the inside that's nice soft to keep your pins well secured and protected, this bad boy is a jewel to have. Makes uh, pin sleeves uh, exciting, makes them fun, makes them enjoyable, I think. It gives them their own personality. And I think people like to use them more because, hey, look at my ink bus. yay! So, anyway, that's cool. So. Before I get to this, let's do a little bit of this still. So, in here I have some pens. That is the Fountain Pen Revolution Himalaya. And then I have the, the new Fountain Pen. Tanoshi. Junior. Yes. And last but not least, I have the Fountain Pen Revolution V2. So those are cool. So let's put some other pins in here. So let's put the Mont Blanc 149. That's a big baby. Holds it well. Let's do the Visconti Blue Lagoon. That matches. Look at the color. I love that. And that's really nice too. So let's just keep adding just a little bit more love to it. And we're going to add the Sajum, the Beatles, Sajum Pepper Pin. And reminds me of a song, Octopus's Garden. Remember that one by the Beatles? Cool song. So 
we'll just put this little tool and they all fit nicely secure and they are safe so yeah this pin will do the job this pin case is like 29 bucks uh yeah that's a decent fair price for the uh for the bag i think so so three pins so the specifications for this pin sleeve I will put it on the description box below. How's that? Okay. It's a durable 420D nylon exterior with a soft, colorful interior polyester plush fabric right there. And that's really sweet. I like that. You can carry multiple cozies in here. In this crazy zipper bag that I'm going to show you soon and it is handmade here in the United States of America in San Francisco <clears throat> so that is cool so let's get through with this bag and then we'll start filling it up and show you what this baby can do Again by Rickshaw is the Ink Journal Koozie Case. It's the Neptune Blue. It matches its brother, the pin sleeve. Cool? Cool. It as well is the, on the specifications, has the 420 nylon exterior with the ink to put card uh, graphics on the front. So they're on both sides of the bag to the bottom of the bag nothing but nice colors like you're in the ocean with an octopus you see the rickshaw tag right here so you know it's quality rickshaw does a fantastic job on pin bags um, so the it has that padded interior It has a padded interior for extra protection and it holds up to eight pins using the rickshaw two and three big uh, pin cozy sleeves and we're talking about these little babies so you can put two or threes in there two to three of these inside that is awesome plus you can do much more things with it use your imagination as well crazy 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 so it also can hold a A5-6 notebooks. That is totally awesome because I don't know about you guys, I always carry a journal with me, a lot of times an A5, because I never know when it, I need to use it. So, and the dimensions will be this bag down below as well. And uh, I do like the paracord, uh, zipper tools right here they're really cool they're really nice and I, I do love the color of it it just matches the bag it just screams coolness isn't it and this beautiful bag is also made here in the USA in good old San Francisco so pin enthusiast are you a pin enthusiast are you a real pin enthusiast come on step up to the plate I know you are. I know you're watching. And I know you're interested. So are you just a pin wannabe? Talk to me. I'm right here. Uh, okay, okay. Stay down. And are you one of those students that like to carry fountain pens or whatever? Ballpoint pen, pencils, whatever that you like to carry in your bag. Are you a writer? Do you do illustrations? Or you're going to go work in your office? Cool. Dynamite. Take these little babies with you. And yes, people are going to say, where did you get those good looking bags? And they're probably going to ask you, what are they? And you can tell them what they are. 
before I go any further, where do you get these beautiful bags at? Well, you can get these at Ink Journal. Yep. And with saying that, I want to say a special thank you to Tom. Otto. For sending me these for review. Thank you, thank you a heck of a lot. So, I'm sure you've seen zillions of reviews on this already, and you're probably saying, oh, here we go, another review. I don't think so. I think uh, this review is kind of special, kind of cool. Why? Because I'm kind of make it kind of pop. So, what do you say? I'm reading notes if you don't mind. We put some stuff in here. So, uh, I'll just put these babies back in. And since I don't have, I don't have the, uh, I think it's the A5 bag, and I don't have the uh, the pin roll, so I can't show you that, but. I'll show you what I do have. This bag, first of all, is nice and deep. And, uh, I think it's about two inches deep. So, that's nice and deep. Let's put the sleeve in there. Well, that's one, right? Okay. So, I have a, what is this? A Knox three pin sleeve here well we can put that in there as well okay so I want to put my A5 calendar notebook in here well, let's do that I'm really cramming this thing aren't I okay so and it, actually there's room for Let's say I want to put my iPods in here as well. And let's say I'm going to take an extra valuable ink just in case and put that in there as well. Okay, I can do that. Oh, I might need a ballpoint pen for whatever reason. I'll put that in there as well. And there's room for more in here. So, all this in this bag right here safe, secure. I mean, you're making the scene, right? This is cool. At least I think it's cool. I think it's like dynamite, baby. Like it rocks. It pops. So, again, where do you buy them at? Where can you get them at? At the ink journal shop. And Tom's right there waiting for that call. Call, call, call. Let's take everything out. So, for real, these are really some fun bags to mess around with. And, uh, you can use really your own imagination. Put whatever you want in there. You know, if you want to just mix it up, you can. And if you don't, you don't have to. Uh, it's up to you. It's your pin bag and pin case so uh be creative be who you are step out of the box yeah don't play follow the leader follow yourself do with your heart and head says well you know what i want to do this or that don't be afraid to do it it's your stuff so what do you think about these awesome pin bag and pin cases totally awesome totally totally awesome so i hope you're getting something out of this review because you know what i know i am it's fun i mean really folks these are some good looking bags and sleeves i'm not just whistling dixie i'm, I'm really i really am digging this they are beautiful so i'm going to end it here i'm going to leave it just like that okay with that, my friends, 
Take care. Have a great day today. And it's soon Halloween. And I think Mr. Announcer is going to put in a little Halloween thing or something. So, be safe. Stay healthy. Peace and love to all of you. And a lot of Halloween hugs to each and every one of you. Dying no my baby! Don't text and drive. Bye-bye. I'm doing a Halloween giveaway right here on my channel. And it's going to be from the Ink Journal. Yeah. It's going to be one of these pen slips. The Rickshaw pen slip. I like them so much that I thought this would be a perfect giveaway. So... Here's what you need to do to enter. On the comments below, tell me what would be your favorite Halloween pin. And then we will pick the winner using the generator, and that will be announced on the 29th. So it starts today, the 22nd, the day of this review, and it will end on Thursday the 29th at 4 p.m. Central Time. Okay? So, tell me what I need from would be your you guys Halloween not only to mention what and then you would use for Halloween or your favorite the Halloween calendar using the uh, generator and that would be announced the on the website nine to the start the color day the twenty second and sleeve you will have this review and put that down and as it well. will end so, okay. name on Thursday the twenty ninth one at two, four PM Central Time. Journal, okay and you'll so choose what I need what from the you, want of the you guys, and you put that down. Not that only scene, to mention what fountain pen October twenty-second you would use for Halloween or your, your favorite Halloween fountain pen. On uh, the, the you would go to the in journal website and choose a color of the pen sleeve you want, and put that down as well. So, okay, name your Halloween pen. One, two. You go to the. Uh, in journal, and you'll choose whatever color you want of the pen sleeve, and you put that down, and that's it. Again, it starts today, October 22nd, as soon as you see this video. It will end on Thursday, the 29th, at 4 p. Central Time. That is it. Happy Halloween, my friend. Ah!